everyone. I wanted to go over one of my favorite new features in Illustrator 2019, uh, the Freeform Gradient Tool and why it rocks. Uh, let's go ahead and make a quick square here, center that up. Uh, select that, hit G, and in the control panel, we have our linear, our radial, but now we have this new freeform gradient tool, and you can see it updates with these nodes that we can drag around, expand the color stops, um, anywhere we want within that shape that we created. It's, it updates instantly, and there's no banding in the gradients. I can even add new nodes, say drag over a pink swatch right on top of it, and it updates on the spot. Um, you could also double click those nodes and change the values directly from here to even HSB and let's update that to a green color. And you can just take this and drag it right off to delete it. It's really cool. Um, now let's go ahead and bring up the gradient panel as well. We see the, the same features. Hit edit gradient to make sure you're in edit mode. We can also add in these really cool uh, Bezier curves to actually add some curvature and some color stops to this freeform gradient. And it edits just the same way by double clicking, you can update the color or you can drag a swatch directly on top. Now, back in the day, to get this effect, we used to use a gradient mesh. So I'll bring that up right here, give it a few rows, and I'll just drag some colors straight onto these points. And you can immediately see how this tool is kind of antiquating the old meshes. Uh, the quality isn't good. You might be able to see if your uh, resolution's high enough that there's actually like a gridded kind of banding effect that's going on in here. Um, it's time consuming. You'd have to uh, drag these tangents and handles to, uh, to change the colors around. And back in the day, this was really neat, but now we have this freeform gradient that's so smooth and so quick. Um, you could also, bring up your graphic styles and create a new graphic style from this freeform gradient that we just made. So now when I create a shape, boom, updates immediately with that graphic style I made. Now I did notice that there's some strange things um, still, like if I create a circle, it doesn't look, same, doesn't look right. It's only adding the green and white. The star does some really weird things. Um, so I think there still needs to be some work here in this tool. Um, to make these uh, graphic styles work properly with freeform gradients. But overall, I'm really happy. Um, let's go ahead and apply this one I made earlier. And as you can see how quickly um, I was able to make the background for the Instagram logo. Um, this is a great tool. Let me know what you guys think of the freeform gradient tool here in Illustrator 2019.